Now let's take a look at a good uh, use case for a 3-axis projection pocketing as opposed to a 3D offset pocketing. So in this particular part, the 3-axis projection pocketing, uh, in this case of 3-axis projection pocketing, the tool always remains completely inside the selected drive geometry or your containment region. Whereas in the case of the offset pocketing, the tool tip stays up to the edge of the region or the boundary that you select. Now a good case for a three-axis uh, projection pocketing would be something where you have a pocket which you have a steep wall and you would want to basically uh, you know have a sculpted bottom on it. So a part like this where you, you do not have a flat bottom so you cannot program using a two-axis or two-and-a-half-axis method. So a three-axis projection pocketing would be a good use case for part like this. So where the cutter completely stays inside the boundary, so you can program the uh, prismatic features on this part using uh, two-axis pocketing, or even you could just rough it out with a three-axis horizontal roughing tool pad, and then finish the uh, floor of the part, which has a sculpted uh, surface, using three-axis projection pocketing. So for parts like these, uh, you could use uh, three-axis projection pocketing, and the the tool completely states inside the boundary, so very similar to your two-axis pocketing where it, it treats the, the region what you select, the dry region as you select as the, ex, the part extends and the cutter stays uh, completely inside the geometry. So parts like these can be ideally programmed using three-axis projection pocketing and again this can be um, accessed under the three-axis advanced methods and you'll find projection pocketing right next to horizontal finishing in here. So the definition of the cut parameters are very similar uh, to what you noticed in uh, you have the option to set the cut pattern to be either a 2D offset or you could go a linear pattern and choose a cut direction, specify your step or now the computation of the tool path in the case of uh, 3D projection pocketing is a lot faster uh, as compared to the 3D offset pocketing.